All right. Uh, switch this resolution real quick. What's going on, everybody? Give me one sec. I'm trying to square this away. All of a sudden, uh, I full screen my game again, and then it just decided to change resolution randomly, even though it was just working perfectly fine and everything was good. Uh, but how are you all doing? Welcome back to another episode of Watch Dogs 2. I hope you all are having a great day. Um, <clears throat> let me see. Make, make sure everything is a good. All right, it is. Hold on one sec. Got to move my stream software back over here. All right. So again, welcome back. Is everything look good now? Are we are we good? Are we back in business? Can you guys uh, see the game and all that? Um. So first things first, I had some research points uh, that I wanted to use, but when I was scrolling through the researches here, I was trying to figure out like, oh, you know, what do I want to get my hands on? You know what I mean? Like, I should probably actually look into some of this gadget mastery stuff at some point. There's some good stuff in here. Uh, but one of the major things I was like, yo, I really want to get this is the uh, where is it? hacking here. Massive system crash. So this shuts down all city infrastructure for 30 seconds. Um, <clears throat> this is huge. This is really, really huge. And uh, I'm like, oh, how do I get this? But it tells you exactly where to go. It says key data in the Gates houseboats. Search the Gates, Gates community for SF electrical grid schematics. Um, and I was, I was searching around the map before I started the stream. And I actually located it up here. The Gates house, houseboats. <clears throat> um, so I'm like, you know what? Before we start anything, let's go over here into the Gates houseboats and see if we can find that schematic. So that's what we're going to do right now. Because uh, that sounds super, super powerful. Callie, how you been, man? I appreciate you all for coming and hanging out today. Okay, so yeah, here's the houseboats. I don't know if this is a restricted... Oh, actually, there's something literally right here. Uh, let's see. Taking it on the roof. Whoa! Shit! Fucking Batman super flip. Um, <clears throat> trying to figure out how the hell do we get to this, but it seems like it's either A, next door, or up on the roof. Yep, here we go. I wonder if I can get it with the drone. If anything. Uh, raise and lower platform. Doesn't seem like it goes. Oh, it does go very pretty high. Okay. So I wonder if I. Oh, okay. All right, so I probably shouldn't be sitting on the forks. It's it's generally not a good idea. Um, but I don't know if you can, like, forklift these pallets. Or not. Oh, you can! Okay, hold on. Here it is, chat. We gotta, we gotta channel our inner forklift operator. Seriously? Yeah. Let's move those out the way. So let me move my body again. 
I don't even know if I'm doing this right, chat, but... <clears throat> it seems like the answer. You know what I mean? Doesn't it- doesn't it seem like the answer? I'm the king of overthinking things. Oh no! Okay, we just gotta raise the forks up a little bit. <clears throat> no, no, not like this. Not like that. Yep, there you go. It's okay. Okay. Alright, we're in there. We're in there now. There it is, chat. There it is. Oh! So this is 100% NOSHA violation, but it's okay. No, 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 no. Okay, yep, that that's why. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm, I'm I'm a little I'm a little stuck right now, chat. Uh There we go. Oh, no, fuck. Damn it. We had it. <clears throat> Alright, this has to be easier. It's gotta be an easier way to do this, right? Well, Caspi said he used the pallets in the front. Yo, that's a fucking genius idea, dude. We should probably bring the forklift up front. It'd probably be a little easier. Well, well there goes a the fence. I like that idea. Here we go. <clears throat> so, did you guys know that Watch Dogs 2 is the forklift simulator? Right, let's, let's make sure we're all the way in. Much better. Yeah, look at that. Seriously, dude, they got me doing everything. He did. Oh, so this was the one that we were looking for, actually. Um, it wasn't in the the area, but yeah, here we know. So now we will have massive system crash. Uh, system crash upgrade would be blackout. And this one is key data in Jack London Square. Well, let's grab this first. <clears throat> okay, so now we have the massive system crash. Shuts down all city infrastructure. We got 30 second window with that. And uh, with this. <clears throat> Jack London Square. Check the map real quick, chat. Jack London Square. Union Square. <clears throat> Gilardi Square. Jack London Square. Civic Center, Japantown. In Oakland? Jack London Square, here we go. <clears throat> yep, in Oakland.
blizzard after thousands of people partying. Okay, so now we're in Jack London Square. Let's run around for a sec. See if we can get a bead on that uh, upgrade. I wish I had a uh, bicycle or something. <clears throat> Still nothing. <laughs> do 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 do. That's right. Yep. Okay, so still nothing in this area. <clears throat> that super sucks said Jack London Square, but obviously it could be freaking anywhere in Jack London Square, realistically. Oh, let's go across the... <clears throat> I'm gonna borrow this person's motorcycle. I'll bring it right back. See it. <clears throat> so it's no luck on the upgrade over here. We'll just have to go with the basic level s system shut down for right now. Does anybody know where in back London Square this subgrade could be? I don't know how close to it I have to get in order to have this it pop up on the screen, you know what I mean? We should actually probably buy a motorcycle. These things are pretty dope. There you go. There's your bike back, bro. I've told you. I promised. All right, let's head. Uh, I I can't find it. It is what it is. Uh, we'll 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 have another opportunity to locate it. <clears throat> but let's head over to Pier Thirty Nine here. We actually have a mission. This is a side mission. It's right by that train in the road. Really, Caspi. Really, Caspi. As we said, it's right by the the train in the road.
There it is. I shouldn't sit down in traffic doing that. It's just not a good idea. Usually. Um, all right. So let me let me do this. Uh, I think it's H, right? We gotta find a way up there. Uh, I see stairs right there in the front. Wrong button, chat. Hit the wrong button. Hit the wrong button. I was gonna dis uh, do the distracting, but uh, I hit the wrong button, and we baseball slid into the dude. So there's that. All right, let's try this again. Uh, less dying this time. That shit is so OP. <laughs> that has to be the most OP thing in the game, 100%. Like, fuck the blackout. Just, just send people a tweet. Or a text message. There it is. <laughs> Alright, now let's get this mission underway. Uh, hey, John, I am glad you're enjoying the... Yeah, this, uh, I like the tech in this one. Like I said, I really wanted to, I really wanted to go hard and, um, mess around with the technology and stuff in this one. 
So we need four more research points if we're going to get the full blackout. But colorful that yo some of those clothes are op man and it's it's not that i think like the clothing itself is op like in like tomb raider or whatever it's it's th like when a game has like craftable unlockable like outfits that give you special benefits and stuff and, but then they also at the same time have re cr like clothing that's just as good if not better it just undermines the fact that they even put the craftable stuff in the game so it's like instead of undermining whole systems of games that's generally why i stay away from like dlc items and chicks i just it's not that they're inherently overpowered it just undermines so many systems like state of the cave and does the same thing like if i were to sit there and just do radio call-ins you know how the fuck do i get on top of this place dude if I were to sit there and just do radio call-ins and call in all the, the, the cars and, and shit like that, it's like, what the hell is the point of even having, you know, normal cars and repair kits and having to work for shit in the game when I could just, like, spend a little bit of a currency and get it just appear magically in front of me? All right, I, I haven't... Okay, maybe we can get up on top... No, that's too high still. How the fuck do I get up there? Oh, sorry, man. This must be how all those bootleggers felt during Prohibition. What I don't get is if I use proxy to get I'm gonna buy it. Like, are we gonna have to? For all intents and purposes, I am in England. Oh, okay. I see. I see. That's a nice car. Yeah, we gotta. It was a lot. I I love these little environmental things. These shits. This this is awesome. Making you use things like this just to get to a mission location. That's so. That's so dope. Oh my god. That's hilarious. Where you at, Slowpoke? Right here, waiting for your ass, Slowpoke. Uh, at least I didn't climb up the wrong building. Oh. <laughs> Fucking shit! <sighs> Thanks for the hand. Yeah, we need with a group of street artists a while back. Showed me how to see the city in a new way. Move through it in a new way. Didn't last long, though. They were more concerned with selling t-shirts than making statements. <sighs> Think you can handle it? Yeah, sure. Uh, piece of cake. But, uh... Good job, you know. Mm. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'll send you some hot spots to get you started. Make me proud. Okay, so we just gotta apply some graffiti. Can you imagine painting all that with this one brush? That's pretty impressive. Okay, so there's a bunch of paint sites all around the map, it seems. Uh, so if we're ever around one of these, yeah, we'll freaking we'll paint those damn things up. All right. <clears throat> We had that mission. I have a mission up here.
Oh, it's like wallpaper. Oh, so we like just yeah, glue, train it. Yeah, it's like we're putting up a big ass sticker, I guess. What? You know what? Just so those little icons aren't just floating around, let's just go do all these really quick right now. Yeah, it's like a big sticker. Okay, so we gotta get up to the roof here. Let's see if there's a way up down here. Or on the back side. They're not dolls. They're not dolls, they're collector items. There it is. Ah, uh, this take you all stream, brother. <laughs> really? So it's not just the four? I mean, we're already one down, dude. We're already one down. Two to go. We're ever easy clapping it. you allow me to scan you? Man, I can't believe it. so many tourists. Hmm. Hello. Get up! Relax, dude. I'm Learn to drive. People are so lucky I'm not savage mode or I would have uh would have had have done things to people in this game. But everybody in chat knows hashtag I am not a savage. So we're definitely gonna have to find a way up, and I'm pretty sure we're gonna have to run across all of these rooftops here. Here we go. It's pretty easy to get to. That's what all savages say. <laughs> what, all savages say they're not savages? I wish I could do that. <laughs> I wish that was in my skill set. Wait, seriously? Come on, let me squeeze through this little hole, dude. Alright, we gotta go get ourselves the access codes.
Go easy, chap. I feel like I've done a really good job, though, so far in this game. Um, not being a savage. Like, you guys can't take that away from me. At least, at least give me that, you know? I haven't murdered any innocents. <clears throat> <laughs> Those backflips are unnecessary, but great at the same. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Completely unnecessary. Where's my moped at? We gotta head over to this. There it is. Ouch. Hey, pal. You think you're funny? Hey, boy, get back on the rough. What are you doing? Relax, people. I was just getting on my moped. Send the, those sh <laughs> those used sugar cookies. What's a used sugar cookie? Hopefully a used sugar cookie isn't a digested sugar cookie. Hey, pull it over. I'm driving here. There we go. We got a guard dog. Did he literally just start trying to kill me right off the bat? He didn't even do anything. Uh, we're all ready for Christmas. Yeah, yeah. Kids uh, start their vacation tomorrow. There it is, Chip. I, they, they started shooting at me so fast. I don't even know what I did wrong. I mean, yeah, I was in the trespassing, but I didn't think trespassing just automatically meant I get shot at. Alright, so we knocked all those out. Oh, Caspi wasn't lying, then more showed up. Alright, let's head up here, we'll do this freaking uh... Dead sec app. Okay, so we got Limp Noodle. Ooh. Yeah, let's do Limp Noodle. I like the sound of that. Meet Ray at the hackerspace. So, Caspi, have you still, uh, gone the whole game without really having to kill anybody?
Yeah, so I, I, I've decided for the most part I will only refrain, I will only uh, lethally kill people if I have to. You know what I mean? Um, but other than that, you know, like those guards, they were just doing their job. There's no reason for me to savagely take their life. You know what I mean? I'm uh, I'm trying to become an, a, a less of a savage. See, both it might sound boring, but honestly, resorting to the gun, and and the reason why. Hold on, let me let's see what they got to say. I'm pumped. No, seriously, activist mode, activate. Hey man, how do we get blown? Hold on to your joystick, son. You kids are gonna need to work your way up to Bloom, even with me help. Bray, are you briefing him without me? We were supposed to do that together. Oh, uh, no, I just didn't want to trouble you. What trouble? No trouble. Come on, Marcus, let's brief. Okay. So, let's that... look at the big shot data harvester. Our friends at Noodle. Now, every time you search for discount refrigerator or bulldozer porn, they learn more and more about you. Data profiling 101? Uh, right. But what you didn't know was that Bloom's already got their grubby paws all over that data. Oh, shit. Oh, this is good, Sitar. Noodle's data is just what Bloom needs to strengthen the bellwether, dig their puppet strings in deeper. You know, if we could get a hold of this ammunition, we could take down a whole lot of different targets. I could help with that. You can't hack Noodle unless you get into the server farm. You can't get into the server farm without clearance. Hell, you can't even get on the grounds unless you're an employee there. Who the hell you think Rob Zombie over here gets his intel from? Well, tell me you got clearance. Psst. Oh, man, I'm trying to stay low-key right now. One of my leads is breathing down my neck. I bet you Marcus can pose as an employee. Oh, he could do more than pose as an employee, Sitara. Tell him what you told me, Horatio. Noodle buses. I snagged an exploit for credentials. I could get you to the buses. All you gotta do is drive it in. They'll think you're one of the bus drivers. Shit. Yo, let's roll, son. All right. Hey. <laughs> uh huh. Let's do this. Hey. Hey, I could I could be a noodle bus driver. Um. But the 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 reason why I I adopted this whole not relying on guns thing was not because you know I'm 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 not, I'm trying to you know not be a super savage like it is what it is you know what I mean if I have to defend myself I have to defend myself but uh I am trying to you know clear my name a little bit because everybody thinks I'm a super savage uh but what I noticed when I played Watch Dogs 1 and a lot of you probably could admit to this too um when I played Watch Dogs 1 I, I just kind of shot my way through everything. Like, I, I didn't really use any of the hacks. I didn't use any of the, like, literally didn't use any of that stuff. It was just because I relied on the guns. Like, I was like, screw, why the hell do I need to hack all this stuff and do all this cool shit when I can just shoot everybody? Uh, so coming into this game, I was like, I want to do more than just shoot because I could go play any fucking open world third person game and just shoot people. But what makes this game unique is all of the technology and hacking and stuff like that. So that's why I'm kind of trying to refrain from killing people just so I can experience the game a little more and not be a savage. I'm not a savage. No, I'm just misunderstood. You know, people don't want to hear my side. They just see me. They just see the end state. You know, they just see somebody get shot dead. And then, but they don't, they don't ask, oh, you know, why did you shoot that guy? Dead? Nobody wants to know any of that. They just, they just see the end state and, and then just run away with it. You know, they just see the dead dog. They don't see my leg gushing blood, you know? Because the dog bit my damn leg off. Yeah, I had the cops do it, Caspi. I'm gonna have to, dude.
All right, so we got the main operation right down the road here. Let's take our little moped. All right, what's up, dude? All right. You ready? Let's roll. Angel, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Reason with the super chat. Imagine Brian being in a buddy cop movie where he's new to the force trying to do things the right way, and his partner is a savage veteran. <laughs> Pure comedy. <laughs> hey. See, listen. Listen, Reason. That is me. You know what I mean? Um, and you guys are the savage veterans that I that I'm forced to work with. Alright? Like like chat claims to, that I'm the savage, but realistically, chat, you guys are all the fucking savages, and I'm over here just trying to do things the right way. The second somebody like walks up to me and they talk shit, you know, like like this guy, like say if he was like, fuck you, chat would be like, shoot him. You know, and then I'd be like, all right, and I would shoot him. And then they would blame me. You guys are Denzel in training day. All right. <laughs> Where'd my moped go? I guess this guy doesn't want to ride on my moped with me. Damn it. So I thought. Yeah, I don't even have the moped unlocked. All right, we'll go with the dead set car. Yeah, we got to go snatch up the bus, but the bus is on the other side of the freaking map. My bad. Um, sorry. Oops. Sorry. So we got to drive over to the bus. Well, hurry the fuck up, dude. I'm not even going fast. Bobby, I'm doing good, man. I punched in the parking lot for you. Driver leaves it there every day to get his coffee. Beautiful. All right, man. Let me just say right up the top. I apologize for anything and everything you're about to see. You kidding? I'm getting an inside look at your alter ego, Horatio Carlin, corporate code jockey. Why do I get the feeling this whole thing was a bad idea? It's cool. I'll go easy on you. There's a noodle bus. I'm a pretty good driver, chat, so I'm, I'm excited to do this. It's my calling. They had fucking tractor trailers in Watch Dogs 1. I don't know if they have them in this one. Okay, now where's the GPS? Hey, sit, sit down. I got it. Oh, come on. All right, just... All right. GPS. I know where the GPS is. Up, uh, up. Uh, got it. There you go. Okay. You guys know I had my class A. Oh, a little, a little turny these buses. Oh, we got we got a bus lane, baby. Hi, how you doing? Hi, 
Hey, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good hey, morning. Hey, how you doing? Good, Gary. Hey there. Hey. Horatio, what are you doing first on the bus? Did, what can I say? Did did you chat? Did I just? Did she say that everybody's walking around sucking robot dicks? Hey, Deleuze, thank you so much for the super chat. I uh, hope you and your family have a great holiday. I love the channel. You know, and your gameplay. Oh, let's see, is it going to read it? Is she going to work today? Hope you and your there family have a great I'm holiday eager, eager. season. Anyway, the juicing love the channel. has really. You and your gameplay keep me laughing. Good vibes for the new year. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I'm glad lighter. you're enjoying I'm it here, too. Freer. I hate to break it to you, but juicing doesn't do squat. You haven't tried my juice. I'm serious. What you want is the pulp. That's the healthy part. Juicing extracts all that. All you're drinking is sugar, smoothies. Now that's where it's at. Load them up with fruit, veg, superfoods. Superfoods? Yeah, like goji berries, maca powder, all that good stuff. You have a lot to learn. You know the science behind superfoods is shaky at best. Well, they're health foods. You can't argue that. Yeah, but goji berries are as much a superfood as grapes are. It's a marketing buzzword designed to rope in consumers. No offense. Really? It's Awkward. fucking traffic, dude. You know, Marcus, there are times when I wish I was out doing what you're doing. And then there's today. Thanks, friend. I'm freaking choking on the pretentiousness in here. And here I thought Bloom employees were bad. Oh my god. Oh. Sorry, guys. Don't know what happened. But like, be honest, chat. That that wasn't savage. I mean, if if you guys had the ability in your pocket, right? If you were sitting at a red light, how many of you guys would just change the light? Like, let's be real. Holy shit! Who's shooting? <laughs> oh, oh, I haven't killed a single person all day today. We tased two people. Um, but yeah, I haven't killed anybody. I've done a pretty good job. Come on, move, dude. There we go. I'm over here fucking following traffic laws and speed limits. Like, is this shit? Oh, damn. Whoa. Ooh, shit, damn. Bus kind of just fuck. Whoa there, buddy. What? I'm fucking driving here. Late last night? Yeah, and the catering me. What is he up to? Okay, like I was saying. Yeah, and the catering made me want to puke. I'd rather starve next time. This new sushi place is so not up to par. The soy sauce was so bland. My spicy tuna roll was anything but. Oh man, that soy sauce just tastes like salt. The worst. Literally, I could think of some worse things. <laughs> Yeah, well, who the hell sideswiped the noodle bus, chat? Wasn't me. I've been driving this thing like a pro.
You know, see that how the game tried to set me up right there? If I had a turn, I'd have, they'd have put that guy in right. Come on, dude, get out the fucking road. What? See, people like that deserve to be fucking. Uh, could you drive better? Bu I wanna be high too. What's he doing? Bumped. Be too? Like he was. Horatio, man, I'm scared, bro. What? What is it? Don't nobody look like us. Oh man, welcome to Silicon Valley. Hey, what do you call a black man surrounded by thousands of white people? What, Mr. President? Hey, man, they see two of us together, they gonna think we plotting. We are plotting. <laughs> well, that's exactly what we are doing. It's harsh, but we have to be firm. I don't even like saying it, but we've tried everything. I'm not man, I feel so. Exposed. Hey, yeah, welcome to my world. There's only three other black people that work here. Two guys, one woman. We have our own mailing list. That's rough. But hey, you're fighting a good fight, changing the face of corporate life in the valley. <laughs> you haven't experienced corporate life until you're the only brother in a meeting and have to represent all of blackdom. Jesus. If I had a nickel for every time someone complimented me for being well-spoken... <laughs> so where's the server farm? Not here, I'm afraid. The whole thing's located under the Noodle Maps building. Hey, Horatio. You'll need a whole other level of clearance to get in there. The managers upstairs can take care of that for you. Just do a repeat performance of the bus hack on one of them, and you're good to go. Let's hit the kitchen. Need fuel before another day of drudgery. Mm. Hey, uh, do you want a coffee? Uh, no, I'm fine. Oh, please, help yourself to a pomegranate. There to die for. You're so great. Thank you so much. Okay, need oak. <laughs> Carlin. Grody. Big day today, huh? I'm excited. How about you? You know, you could just tell us what you've been up to. Where you've been looking, who you've been just talking to. Trying to get to. a coffee. You know, shit. What was that? Just trying to get a coffee. Yeah. Yeah, all right. I'm sure you'll be more forthcoming with HR. <laughs> Enjoy that coffee. Watch it! Are you new here? Yeah. Hmm. Punk would love to lay his ass out. I can't stand that mother... Hey, Becky. Gentlemen. He's been watching my ass since the day I got here. Now he's saying I should be more forthcoming with HR? You think he's got something on you? Do you have any idea how much jail time I'd be looking at? If I can get into the server farms, I can delete all that shit, all right? We got your back. You're not going in jail. I'll be in touch. All right? All right. All right. Pomegrapples. What the fuck is a pomegrapple, chat? All right, Horatio, what's the plan for getting to the noodle server farm? Best option is the elevator maintenance area on the second floor of Noodle Maps, but watch yourself. This will be painless, Security's I tight. You. Even I don't have access. No sweat. The scan was interrupted. Okay, so is this like a whole, like... Greetings. Complex? Oh, hey. Would you allow me to scan you? Yeah, okay, it's a whole complex. Okay, so there's a Noodle Maps building. Okay, we gotta get access. Okay, so there's access to, uh, in this building. There we go. <laughs> so it's locked by the access key, but the access key is inside. Yeah. 
Okay, so we do have a vent here. Now, I wonder if we're authorized to be upstairs. Right there. Let's go see. Okay, so this is not restricted. So, and that's the room that we got to get into. Okay, guys, straight up, the hacker space needs a slide. Kind of hard to have a slide on just one floor. Let's work on that. Vertical expansion. Sorry, chat. I had to do it. All right, so we got to get up into this vent. The only thing is my robot doesn't jump high enough to get up in there. I could get my drone up in there, but the drone, I don't think can do that. I, if, if we need physical hacking, it's not going to work. All right, I am now Miss Laura Kim. How do I get into Noodle Maps? If you've got access keys, you should be able to just walk right in. Yeah, that was pretty easy. <laughs> Thank you for your patience. So they're saying now that we have those access codes, we can just walk in, I guess. security don't fool around so watch yourself hey this is Laura Kim you're talking to Okay, so I don't have full access to this building. We got to get upstairs. Uh, let's see if we can get on the cameras. So I wonder if I have to get in through that door. There's a lot of vents here for the jumper. Yeah, so it seems like that terminal here is what controls everything. So that area is restricted over there. So we're going to have to go ground. Yep, I've decided to move to Oakland. Interesting. I cannot stand the scene downtown. The hypocritical bourgeois vibe makes me sick. Huh? You catch that? Whoa, that's weird. Quit 
creeping up on me. Never do that again, you hear me? Got it. Okay, so now we have access to both doors. Whoops. I had to stop buying early access games. Every time I fall into the same. Um there is cameras in that room. But I kinda I kinda wanna go in through this side, but there's guards and a camera there too. I can distract the guard, turn off the camera. But I have that ability. I could turn the camera off, distract the guard, and then walk up the stairs. Camera's off. See if we can get on the any cameras up here. Sector sweep complete. Okay, so we got one guard up here. So many fucking terminals, man. Okay, so we gotta unlock that terminal in order to get into this office. Can go through the ground level here. There's a couple cameras and uh, bots, but we could shut those all down uh, while we do the hack. But there's no physical guard, so it's not really that big of a deal. Damn, Gaiman, thank you for the membership. Welcome to the family. Oh, I am allowed in the next room. Yeah, look at that. Right here. Uh, we just got to get this open, which, yeah, should be too easy. Let's take a stroll. Uh, that's the room we have to get in, right? Seriously, bro, take your time. No pressure. Keep it together, Ratio. I'm almost at the elevator shaft. Okay, so security personnel. So probably just shut this robot down. Sector sweep complete. Just leave it. Oh. Party bot sequence initiated. Robots have an inherent understanding of rhythm. A robot in the streets. A man toward the ship. Excuse me while I crush them. The robot is distracting the shit out of the guards. Let's go. I remember this part. I went gun hole. See, and that's what I'm trying not to do. You know what I mean? Because I could, I could literally just tase all the guards or shoot all the guards and sneak into here. How many of you guys literally just like? What's happening? How many of you guys just like kind of cleared your way through these? <laughs> what happened? Did I trip some kind of sensor or something?
Hey, bro, I've gotten to the elevator. Horatio? He's gone dark. Hold on, we're trying to find him. Do I use a green screen? Uh, like, like behind me? Yeah, yeah, there's a green screen behind me. Okay, so none of this area is restricted, actually. Satara, it's a dead end. I need Horatio's code to get into the server farm. Any luck finding him? Got his GPS, but he's not responding. I'll patch you in now. Oh, shit. Jokes on your computer is evidence enough to put you away. I just, I want to hear you say it. You have no idea how happy it'll make me to hear you say you fucked up. <laughs> Look, man, I don't want to be the bad guy here. Here's your reality just between us. You will go to jail for cyber terrorism. That can't be avoided. But if you cooperate with us, maybe you'll get a reduced sentence. So why don't you just start talking to us and save us all some grief? What do you say, my man? No. Uh. God, that's annoying. Okay. No, don't touch it. All right, just just leave it. All right, it'll turn off on its own. All right. Maybe. You don't know a damn thing about me, man. What? Did you... Did you want to confess? Confess? What? Let's talk when you're ready to confess. <sighs> what? The... How did... Who listens to this crap anyways? Sit. This place is a freaking circus. Side team morons better do something. You wired everything in the building to the same network down to the freaking toy. You think you can stop it all from going haywire? Yeah. Okay, and here's a hot tip. Don't, don't apologize. Just get it right in the first place. Yeah. You think? I know. Uh-huh. Really? Oh, Yasmin. Four, three, seven, seven, eight. Carla needs a very serious accusation to you've been making. I had prepared to kill room. Well, uh, the evidence speaks for itself. Mr. Carlin, I'm going to ask you to follow me. Damn. All right, so we got to go wipe the server. You're the man, Horatio. Hang in there. Okay, locate the central server. They got things wired up pretty tight here. Oh, fuck. Okay, uh... What <laughs> the fuck is this?
Okay, so do I just have to unlock all of them? I mean, how do we know it's one that we need? Oh, I can hack the one right from here. Mm -mm. Okay, there it is. This is it. Okay, so I need to get this door open. So power to here will be enough. Oh, so we hit this junction point here. Should open both, right? Data is now dead sex data. I'm out of here, but Horatio's still in the spot. Can one of y'all help a brother out? We have access to every workstation in Noodle, including Horatio's. And this Brody guy. I'm almost done sorting it out. Well, let's see. All right, done. Let's see how Horatio's doing. I'm sorry you chose not to cooperate with us. I would highly suggest you seek legal counsel. Yes. And you tracked the keystrokes? I see. Thank you. Mr. Carlin. I... I am so sorry. Apparently, we've made a, a huge mistake. I... What a surprise. My apologies. Uh, yeah. you, you are free to go. I'm just glad you finally got it right. Whoa, 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 this is a mistake. I mean... Mr. Goodell, take a seat. I don't... Okay, I don't think that... Sit down! Yo, why can't we blame it on that dude? Ratio, that was intense. You good? I'm better than good. Where you at? Meet me out front at the noodle bus. Uh, Michael asked weird, but why did you pick YouTube? Uh, YouTube is just a bigger platform in general um, than Twitch is, uh, Michael. So, for instance, like I, my main game that I would stream was State of Decay 2. Uh, now, for instance, if I stream State of the K2 on YouTube, I could have a thousand live viewers watching me um, stream the game. If that's more viewers than that's like ten times more viewers than the whole entire Twitch category for State of Decay, and there could be 30, 40 streamers streaming uh, State of the K. Uh, there's just a bigger viewership on YouTube hey, I'm in when it comes to everything. Any ideas on how I can get out of here? Yeah, I got you covered. 
There's a, a drainage conduit at the back that should take you into an exterior access. Nice. Thanks. Um, and it's just where I started. You know, I started making videos on YouTube, so I just kept everything here. Well, hopefully this doesn't fill back up. Swapped out Horatio's keystrokes with Gooddale's? Nobody gives our Horatio a hard time and gets away with it. That's real crafty, Satara. I'll take that as a compliment. Uh, and just like Cryptic says, better learn long-term potential on YouTube as well. Really only very... Exactly. E exactly. Like, Twitch is good for, you know, the top, you know, couple hundred streamers that they have on there. But overall, everybody else kind of... Falls to the wayside. Uh, what the hell? Losing connection to network bypass. What are they talking about? Uh, but one of the main benefits for YouTube, I think, personally, over Twitch is the VODs. You know what I mean? Like, all my streams uh, are videos for people to watch at their leisure, and uh, Twitch doesn't support that. So, like, they have VODs for, like, but it's it, it's very sporadic. There's no playlists, and, you know, it's just, it's just very... I feel like YouTube is just a better um, platform for people to consume content. Uh, JB, I appreciate that, man. And thank you, everybody, for almost 250 likes on the stream. I do appreciate it. All right. Let's meet up. See, we didn't have to kill a single person. It's gold, Marcus. Gold. Bloom's definitely tapped into Noodle's pipeline. They've even given Noodle limited access to their content. I'm all for singing Kumbaya, but this shit's got Dushan written all over it. For Bloom and Noodle to be cooperating like this, it's a major find. But it scares the fuck out of me. Oh, come on, guys. Noodle ain't that bad. Hey, enjoy the dump, but save a beer for me, all right, Wrench? Right now, I've got some code to... Code. Hey, thanks, man. Appreciate everything you did for me. For sure. But uh, right now, can you get the hell out of here? You're making people nervous. <laughs> oh, hey, did you try Pomegrapple? It was good, right? You look like someone with a lot of valuable information. Now, tell me everything you know about Dead Sec. Huh. Who is that? Somebody flipping on us? Okay, so we got taking down Bloom. Gather followers to take down Bloom. If you want to take down Bloom, we need millions of followers to download our app to strengthen the botnet, okay? So I think we have to do this home intruder. Hack in Nicole Lang's apartment. Local police are increasingly alarmed by the violent acts of the Tesco Street Gang. They have recently been linked to several East Bay killings, the violence of which has been described as extreme even for gangs, according to experts. The chief of police issued a warning that CTOS and law enforcement will protect San Francisco from criminal organizations by the full extent of the law. Gangs were like in the first one. We haven't, I, I, I don't know if we even have to deal with the gangs in this one, but. It would be cool. 
So right now, the only people we're going up against is CTOS. Didn't bloom and shit. Okay, here we go. I did enjoy the first. Oh shit! Don't don't do it, dog. Don't do it. Okay, we're cool. Friendly dog. Oh shit! What the fuck? Uh, hello, Sitar, Josh. Please tell me this is not what I think it is. Marcus, you hear me? <sighs> yeah, I got you now. I'm getting trolled. Did our app server get hacked? Might want to get back here when you can. Hacker war. Okay, so we gotta get into this dude's house. I wonder if I can access that. No, that requires a physical hack. Um, and the drone can't do physical hacks, can it? Nope. It's all good. We can just climb up here. It's not a restricted zone, so we don't really have to worry about it too much. I'm looking through my kitty feeds now, man. Ladies and gentlemen, Snowflakes. pervert cold. Fucking menace. Let's wreck his world. Bath time. I got a never ending supply. Okay, so when can we meet? Because I need something new for the weekend. Uh, prices are going up, Grizz. This is exclusive material I'm providing. One customer, one kid. I don't know, man. You're not the only dealer in town anymore. This is primo. Oh, hold on, Grizz. Honey, put on your pajamas and brush your teeth, please. What is it? Oh, something's coming that you're really gonna like, Grizz. I'm gonna need two grand. Two grand? Are you out of your mind? Two grand is a fucking bargain. I could go to jail for this shit. You should go to jail for robbing me. You already have my fucking life saving. You know what? Forget it. Ah, what the fuck are you doing, Grizz? I didn't do anything. Well, can you hear me? Yeah, I think that was on your end, man. Must be a bad connection. Um, okay, okay what was I saying? Something about screwing me. Oh, right. <laughs> Fuck me! Grizz, are you still there? Trial of labor, piece of shit! <laughs> Six, eight, eleven? Jesus, everyone wants preschoolers. Once they hit grade school, they're too fucking old. Hon, my headset's on the fritz again. I gotta hit the store. Really? Cool. Did you get all that? Yep. Jesus 
Christ. I wish I could reach through the camera and strangle that guy. Don't worry. This footage is already circulating. Society will do the strangling soon enough. There it is. Marcus, one of our latest followers sent me this. Consider it a follow-up on home CEO. Yo, check it. I was on the treadmill when this pissy-looking guy came up with a trainer and kicked me off. Dickhead looked familiar, so I asked around the gym. It was Steven Bader, the guy in charge of home. I guess waiting for a treadmill is too lowly for rich assholes like him. All right, so we got this hacker shit going on our screen right now. What we got to think about shooting a little exercise fail video starring the CEO of home. Steven Bader? I'd love to have another go at humiliating that pompous ass. Why an exercise video? Peeping Steve is at the gym right now. Buckle in and get ready for a show, my friend. <laughs> Christmas is coming early this year. Right, hacker war. Let's do this. So we can get this shit from popping up on our screen. <clears throat> uh, is monetization better on Twitch or YouTube? Uh, it, it all just depends. Um, I, I can't. Hackers flagging terrorists for the FBI. It seems that's the bureau's plan. With cyber attacks on the rise and the CTOS integrated into every aspect of how our city functions, the FBI has taken extreme measures to protect that technology. A congressional report reveals that the FBI is pushing for expanded powers to pressure hacker groups for specific techniques. The FBI also wants to be able to identify and flag hackers and hacker groups even if there is no evidence they've committed any crime. Freedom of information advocates say this is an unprecedented request that threatens civil liberties. Um, but I can't speak uh, because it, it's all different for everybody. You know, what works for one person might not work for another person. Um, but the only thing I can say about you, YouTube uh, compared to Twitch is it's faster to get monetization on Twitch. Like, it's easier to, to, to get uh, to the point where you are monetized. YouTube is a bit harder because you require the requirements are a lot higher um, and it couldn't take a very long time to get monetization on YouTube. But I would say if you are to the point where you're monetized on one or the other, uh, YouTube takes a lower percentage than Twitch does. But like I said, it all just depends on um, you as a creator, really, because uh, there's some people that would say Twitch works better for them. And then there are some people that would say, you know, for my case, you know, we're, YouTube works better for me. Um, but it all just depends. Uh, do I have any sponsors? No, I don't have any like direct, like actual sponsors. Um, I've had people reach out to me, but it's all stuff that I really don't want anything to do with for the most part. Um, and I'm not just going to sit here and jump on, you know, whatever's available. Fucking Lenny. We're not letting these trolls drag us into their sewer. Deadsec doesn't back down. So what? Well, what good is going to war with them? It won't break their lock on us. It doesn't change anything. They got in. Shoot. Oh, fuck that. Hey, listen up. We're not going to let Primate derail us. Let's be smart about this. Shoot. Right. 
Primate sells zero-day exploits to anyone with money. Yeah, fucking governments, Bloom, Noodle, even goddamn terrorists. Sons of Ragnarok. What? Hell yeah, Sons of Ragnarok. They hire themselves out to Sons of Ragnarok, right? So we find out as much as we can about their people and their operations. We're not gonna roll over, not for anybody. Yo, Josh, man, where you at? Now it's war. Move. I'll put a message out on the back channels. These guys are bound to have enemies who will give us some intel. Let's cornhole these motherfuckers. <laughs> you mean you didn't want to pitch the Scottish Lordship titles? No, dude, I Keep didn't. Keep working on Kiki. I'm going to go have some work <laughs> with Lenny. You know where she's at? She likes to hang at that club in Castro. I know the place. <laughs> No, yeah, I mean, uh, once you get to a certain point in, uh, you know, content creation, I, I, I get, you know, and Cryptic could probably even say it too, like, we get tons of sponsorships. I mean, tons. I, I, I have emails just... Like, I, if I were to take every sponsorship that was given, I'd probably be a millionaire, legit, because there's, there's so many. But my thing is, is I'm not going to sit here and pitch bullshit to you guys you know just for the sake of money um I, it's not stuff i believe in and that, that's why i try to tell you guys all the time is i'm not gonna stand here and do a sponsorship just for the sake of doing it i'm not gonna pitch shit to you guys that i don't truly believe in or back um because you know that's just it's not it's not right um I don't want to abuse my Marcus, position. You got a second? Sure. What do you need? I've been looking into the algorithm we scoped from Noodle and something's off. The data it's throwing out is all wrong. You want me to stop by and take a look? Yeah, if you can. Consider it done. Uh, so if I do get behind something and pitch it, it's generally because it's either something AI I actually use or something that I think is actually cool or that you guys would benefit from. But outside of that, hell no. I'm not about that life. All right, so I did get these 12 points. I want to activate this massive communication district. No, that's not it. Is that the one? No, we wanted this one. System crash upgrade blackout. <clears throat> so we're going to get this. You see, I got four more points. Gang attack. I still don't understand this gang attack. Assign a target to one of the gangs of San. Oh, so I can just like have gangs come and kill people? <laughs> Let's do it. I mean, that's a little savage to, you know, sign somebody up for a drive by. But <laughs> it's better than me having to do the drive by, right? All right, so here we go. We got Lenny's demands. Confront Lenny. I will pull the trigger on, trigger on Lenny, though. Like, 100%. After that freaking trolling-ass message, 100% pulling that trigger. And I don't think you guys will blame me for that, right? All right. Whoever sent me this is going to freaking pay. No, what? Uh, I don't know. I was asking you. Uh huh. All right. Let's do this, Lenny. Just kill everybody in here. No, we, we, we won't. Let's at least see what. Yeah, badass. 
looks oh, good. Oh, fuck. Ready for the chip, then? Ah, uh, hold on. I'm savoring. Oh, look at this dick bag. So, how many lap dogs you got scrambling behind the scenes to crack my uncrackable lock? Credit where credit's due. Now, uh, you want me to ask nicely? Because you could just give me the key and I'd be on my way. What? It's ransomware, motherfucker. Which means you want what? Oh, I want you to make one of those idiotic vids of yours. Wow, I didn't know you were a follower. Oh, you want the precious pros to adore you? Not on my fucking watch. <laughs> Fuck! I want a public broadcast that says dead sec isn't worth two seconds, never mind 15 minutes of the public's fucking time. Spice it up. Add some tears. Is that all? Sure. For now. But if you don't do it, then I start naming names. <gasps> That's right. Names. Identities. A veritable zoo, bitch. Damn, looks like you're not leaving us much choice. Ah. Go ahead. Get good. Until then, why don't you run along and make the video I want? If I could, chat, gun in her mouth, right in her mouth. Arr. Right here, right now, splashed her shit all over the place. What does she want? She wants us to release a vid where we smear ourselves. No way are we doing that. We're gonna send her a message, all right? We're gonna blow up her shit instead. Ragnarok just hired Prime 8 to upload malware into ATM. <laughs> Bank machines it is, folks. They run that through their main club hangout, Rhonda's Diner. I'll send Ghoulie there to scope the place. Meet up with him when you get there. Here we go, champ. So I am gonna straight up kill her like 100% there's there's no if I if the opportunity comes we're not gonna taser we're gonna shoot her you guys can call me savage all you want I can't I can't <laughs> can't let that one slide Shirley how you doing today party dude It seems like chat understands. We're at the bar in Sausalito. Come on over. Wouldn't miss it. See, the thing is, is DeadSec was a pretty big deal. Like, like the group was quite scary in the first game, weren't they?
Here they got dead tech feeling like I want to say amateurs because we're definitely not amateurs, but it definitely seems like there's other groups that easily can rival dead sec at the moment. A biker so, gang? What's say, Retro? Ragnar boys hired Prime 8 for some machine hacks, huh? Ragnarok has been using credit skimmers for a long time. Low scale payoff. But hiring P8 to load malware into the bank machine has <laughs> tripled their cash flow. I'll bet it has. The code skims the data and sends the copy to P8. Neither the user nor the bank have any way of knowing. Ah, but we know. <laughs> yes, we do. Won't take much to mess with their code. Imagine how pissed Sons of Ragnarok will be with Lenny and Primate if anything were to happen to that operation. That's the idea. It's gonna be dangerous. You hang back, Ghoulie. All right, man. Good luck. Time to fuck up this operation. Okay, so what the hell do I have to do? Uh, destroy the rigged ATMs. Alright, ATMs are here. Destroy the machines however you want. Okay, so let's try to get an idea of what the hell is going on here. Is there any cameras? So I can't get a visual on what's over here yet. This is going to be a little bit harder than I thought. Alright, ATMs are here. Destroy the machines however you want. Watch it. 
Lenny says these guys aren't as dumb as we think. Well, yeah, just think that it'd be Group of units, CTOS has identified a suspect in a human trafficking ring near your location. These guys move to detain. Over. So they're doing something right. Stay on him. We'll have to catch you up. Go chat. Let's see how this goes. Called in the police. Thanks for the advice. I am getting a gaming PC next month and want to stream. Maybe collaborate one day? Oh, maybe, Michael. It's hard for me to collaborate with people because um, I have so many people that want to collaborate with me. I can't collaborate with everybody. Um, so it's one of those things. If I can't if I can't do it with everybody, I don't do it with anybody type of deal. Because uh, it's just not fair. So these guys are full blown fighting it out with the police. But Michael, thank you for the super chat, man. I do appreciate it. So I wonder if the police are going to keep coming because they keep killing the cops. Shit, let me use... Let me call in that gang hit. Maybe the gang hit, because... I want to see how effective this is, too. We got to swoop down on these nosy bitches. Cut them off at the knees. These dudes are these dudes are not bad, Jet. Like everything I'm calling in on them, they're just fighting it off like it's nothing. Bro, I'm about to hit the road for a few days over Christmas, family and stuff. Oh shit. Have a great Christmas, holidays period yourself and everyone in chat. Hey, goo. Hey, have a good time, brother. I hope your holiday is great, man. And thank you so much for the support, brother. I really appreciate that super chat, man. And I do I wish I wish your holiday the best. That didn't work out, um, at all. So let's try to call in the police again. Dispatch to squad. Suspected arsonist has turned up on CTOS near your location. Engage when ready. Over. If this doesn't work, I'm just gonna have to go in here and just tase. Oh, they got him. They actually killed him, the cops. Okay, so this is actually a pretty big fight. Copy that. 
Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. They know where I am. How did I get spot? Oh, they might have seen me standing up there. Yeah, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to take these guys out, man. I mean we did what we were we did what we were supposed to do. We called the cops, you know. We called the authorities. This is going a bit better now. Oh, I could have done that with my fucking jumper. Oh, so can the rover... I, I didn't know if I would be able to, but it seems like I can destroy the, uh... ATMs with the rover. Down here, chat. Look at this. Yeah, we really did cause hell. Okay, so it looks like there's a uh, security camera in here. Me, I uh, get the rover down. Turn that off. Think we made our point? It's as though a bajillion people exploited by zero day fraud cried out in gratitude. Lenny's gonna have a hard time explaining this to the sons. Yeah, that cop calling, that's pretty useful, man. Uh, Daryl, thank you for the sub. Barely had to lift a finger. Telemarketing charm right there. So, we're Purple not dragon snot cocks. <laughs> do whatever. Don't even care. Not two shits given. I know my lock is still on your server. Lenny's right. Kiki's still locked, Marcus. Doesn't matter. Game time is done. 
We go to their digs and get the decryption key. Back channel info says P8 has a bunker. <gasps> a bunker? But there's no location. Lenny has a RFID implant. Can we find the bunker with the... Okay, so that RFID chip that Lenny has in her arm is actually humongous. So, uh, hopefully the chips are a little smaller than that in the future, chat. If, if, if we're going to have chips implanted in our body, I want them to be a little smaller than that. It's not really my style. It, it li literally looked like she had a, a cell phone. In her arm. What is this? It's called... Thank you. We need to save up for a new car at some point, too. I don't mind the dead set car, but we gotta get some... Once we start making some real big cash, we gotta... We gotta get something fancy. keep going with this <laughs> i hate you for fucks <laughs> and you know why the propaganda vids the graffiti the anti-whatever do-gooder bullshit you assholes take yourself so fucking seriously oh you coming at us but you need to understand we are all in this together we can all hey what kind of fucking noob do you think i am <laughs> what kind of shit stain are you for getting caught? I just thought it was worth a I... shot. <laughs> See how far you get with dead servers, loser. Yeah, shoot her. Oh, was that like a hacker gun or something? Did he get the... I think he got the codes we with that. We got a ping on the Prime 8 bunker. And Lenny is clueless about it. Maybe. Come on. You guys give her too much credit. He had, I thought it was a sniper rifle, but now that I, I'm thinking about what happened, I think he just sniped the codes out of with whatever that was. Wrench, important question time. Aliens versus predators. Ooh. The question doesn't make predators. sense. I mean, aliens basically no. use predators as an external womb to perpetuate their species. And the predators, well, they come from a world where you hunt or you die. They need xenomorphs to hone them into elite warriors. It's a fucked up ecosystem that doesn't really have a winner. Okay, ignoring the science behind it. Purely hypothetical. One on one, who wins? Uh, predators. Are we talking Ridley Scott or Cameron? I like the sequel better. Let's go with them. Marcus, that's a bold statement. We need to have that conversation later. But versus a Cameron alien, they're more aggressive, so the predator wins easily. He's way ahead on a technological level, so he's gonna stand his ground when the Xeno rushes him. But that's like asking who wins between one man and one zombie. The aliens hunt in packs. Okay. Okay. How many aliens would make it a fair fight with one predator? Ooh. Three. Three? I could see a predator spearmaster keeping two away with a Yelcha combo stick, but a third Xeno is going to be able to get in close. Even if he kills it, that blood splash is going to melt right through him. It's a hard call. You'd have to plug their stats into a probability algorithm. Yeah, they both fought Judge Dredd, which is pretty badass. Aliens fought Batman. So did Predator. 
Let's not forget Superman and Batman versus Aliens and Predator. Who won? Can I remember? Doesn't matter. You know what? I give the overall win to Predator. Yeah? Enlighten me. Predator has taken on Archie. Shit, you're right. Archie's basically the top of the food chain. You think Predator's more of a Betty or a Veronica type of guy? Neither. Gotta go with Sabrina. Ooh, you make a good argument. I buy it. Predator comes out on top. That that hey. That, that that's a plan? that's Get a tough one key, right there, chat. Can we have the bunker? Because like after seeing like xenomorphs in action, like they're no fucking joke. You know what I mean? But if you watch the Alien and Predator movie, I haven't watched that movie in, in forever. But the, like the Predators were fighting multiple xenomorphs. You know what I mean? Even though I feel like the xenomorphs in that movie were a little underpowered compared to what they are in like you know the other movies i feel like they were a little underpowered in alien versus predator but i don't know that's tough man that's tough you need to save up for a sailboat <laughs> i gotta do those drone races too now that we have those unlocked Okay, guys, what's the plan? Well, Lanny's got that door seriously locked down. So, plan B? I got something. There's an old exhaust duct. Probably overgrown, so... I'll find it. You said a T-800 beats Predator? I, I don't know. I mean, I still think it's BS that, you know... Arnold beat a Predator. That, that, that doesn't make any sense, realistically. Like... That predator should have just erased everybody. That was like the lowest of the lowest rank of pres predators. I don't know. Do you guys really think a Terminator could beat Predator just hands down, no problem? We got to figure out how to hell we get up here. I have not played Crisis yet, no. Fort's is fucking secure. That's one thing you can bet your ass on. Lenny's got this bunker locked down like Fort fucking Knox. No one's getting in here. Not the Germans in the war, and not dead sec now. However much they piss and moan. Actually, I wouldn't mind going in for a while. I'm sick of staying out here on watch all the time. Tell Lenny that. <laughs> Need to do it first try, Cassie? I don't know, dude. First things first. Let's get a... Idea of what we're dealing with. So we got three enemies. I mean, if I was just on shoot 'em up mode, I could. You, you know how easy it'd be for me to infiltrate this place. Four headshots. We're in chat. So these guys are... Oh, so the AI is all different. They don't always just go into shoot mode with the police. 
Uh, th- that biker gang, they instantly shot it out with the cops. I spoke too soon, chat. (laughs) I spoke too soon. So we're going to let them chill out. After that explosion. And uh, we should be in there. No problem. Nothing. Let's give it up. We're in there like swimwear. Caspi, please tell me this isn't the 45 minute puzzle, bro. I'm inside. Ooh, ooh, stinks of beer and cheesy feet. Just get that decrypt key, fast. I'm in your house, fucking up your shit. Why do you say it like that? She's rigged the place to blow. What? What are we looking at? Two, no, three. It looks like shit. <laughs> Maybe four. They don't seem connected, so I don't think the order matters. How many notes? Just find another way out. Guys, guys, I need to concentrate. Wait, 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 wait. I, I don't, I don't, I don't understand what I got. It. Okay. We got explosions. Go to this. We'll flip this. Here. Yeah, then we need to get power in from the top side. Put that like that. Put that open. Double power going that way. Need power to come in from the top here. (laughs) 
Wait, what the fuck? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Did, oh my god, are you kidding me, dude? So now we got to get the power to go this way. Spin that that way. Rotate. Okay, two out of four. Rotate it down. Three. Stop being a Fucking bitch! Jesus Christ, dude. Seems like I handled the booms. This is not fucking over. Um, yeah, it is. That was ridiculous, man. I had a whole minute to spare. <laughs> how, how much time did you have to spare, Caspi? That was a pretty tough puzzle, man. I'm not going to lie. I, I, I definitely thought that they slayed me with only giving me five minutes for that. <laughs> you said you had a second, bro. Hey, there you still made it, dude. That's all that matters. <laughs> hey, Marcus. Home sweet hacker space. It's finally rid of that prime eight smell. Is it ready? Yep. Wrench had to spray a bit of bombs be gone, and then whoosh. Go check it out. I see the side blew up first time on that part. I thought I for sure was. Ca I, I thought I was definitely going to get blown up 100%. Okay, so what is this here? Meet dead sack. Okay. <clears throat> oh, once you get the 10 seconds, they start. Oh, that would be rough. That's just like a mental. A mental fuck right there. Hey, Marcus, Copyright. This is Roxanne in Tang War. That's that's Elvish. Hey, Sitara. Hey, put this up on the screen, Josh. 
It's from Miranda. You're being followed. A friend of mine has given this to you at great risk. Watch your backs. There's a target on it. Target? What? That's us. That mask is so dope. Right now. Let me check this one out. Someone's spying on us from right outside. Hey, hey, hey. Motherfucker. Let's fuck if I ain't shit up. Hey, be cool, man. Sneak out. I'm gonna go out the front and see if I can uh, spot our tail. Yeah. Marcus, check out these texts I pulled from a cop. Any luck? Cryptogram? I was obsessed with these things as a kid. Damn, that takes me back. Think you still got it? I'd love it if Dad said could one up the cops on this. Our followers would eat it up. You just give me that cryptogram, son, and I'll see what I can do. There's a van. Yeah, that's them. Get what you can on. What do you mean? I think I gotta physically do this. Or get close. Oh man. Who are these people? They got a ton of stuff on us. Lots more photos and looks like a map of Josh's daily movements. Other stuff? What the hell? Shit, oh shit! What? It's FBI. You hacked into the FBI. Listen, I got into their comm channel. Somebody's trying to access our data source. Get all agents out here. Converge on the suspect. Watch for movement. Hey, I'll run them out. No location on the suspect. Checking next area. Time to take out the competition, I'll go. We see them, and we're going in. What's going on? Some hot shit anti-hacking demon picked up on what we're doing. Hold on a sec. Oh, man. Fixed. About time. I'm a little busy right now, Wrench. Ah, totally. Check everywhere. Yo, we got word of some punks busting in on us. I'm DMing you now. That went well. It's kept the police distracted with the gangs. That worked out pretty damn good.
There's no sharks in this game, is there? I think that went. I think that went pretty well. All right, let's see. We got sixteen points. So wanted criminals. So we can upgrade this. That'll make the cops come and kill them. Rally high level members of gang to rough up your targets. This replaces. Oh yeah, see that's good. <laughs> So these are really good, chat. Like the uh these distractions, they're they're really good in my opinion. Well, how far are we from upgrade? So we need What is this? This is all for gunplay, which I don't really I'm not really shooting it up right now, so it doesn't really matter. Proximity scanner. Enhanced scanning cap NPCs are tagged through wall. Oh yeah, yeah. We'll grab that. You did, and punched out one agent when he got too close. I felt like where I was on that roof, the chances of them coming up there and seeing me were pretty much non-existent. Uh, but who knows? You know what I mean? They could have easily made their way up to where I was. All right. So where is part two of this mission? Okay, so there's no part two to that yet. Side up nine one one. Meet Joss at the hacker space. Oh, they do go up there. Oh shit. Well then, yeah. Good thing I did what I did. Wrench, what is it? We're messing with the FBI, man! We gotta totally restrict communication on this. Okay, but... Uh... Minimal communication, M. Face-to-face -face is best. Meet me at the place where... You know where. Wrench? Wrench! Damn! To the cafe, then. Alright, let's see. Marcus? We've been trying to contact Horatio. He's not answering and his phone doesn't show any movement. Can you make sure he's okay? I'll mark his phone on your map. Sure. Shit. Well, I was going to start this hey, night. Uh, one of our newbie followers reports something strange. Anybody heard about a bunch of funky rat masks hanging around outside the MoMA? Bunch of self described art anarchists calling themselves the Ordinate Academy. Rodentia Academy. It's an anagram. Good catch. What's their platform? Total transparency. No privacy for anybody. Then why the masks? These rat masks. What do they look like? Stylish. Low poly. Fuck. That's default. Default? The musician? Wasn't he default in the first game? The ex -dead -sec hacker. Default, the psychopath asshole who tried to gas me in his fucked up spook show house. Okay. I'm definitely gonna check these guys out then. Gives me a chance to meet one of the new followers too. Yeah, I was gonna say default was in the first game. Oh, yeah, it's all good. Well, you know what? <laughs> and thank you guys for almost 350 likes on the stream. I do appreciate it. Uh, you like this place, huh? Food is average. Uh, get anywhere? I can't tell if she thinks my mask is hot or creepy. The main FBI office is in the Delamus building. We really need the rest of that data. Because? Because... 
Something hinky's going on, man. Something big. Different hackers I know, they've been noticing vans following them around and shit. Uh, well, it wouldn't be the first time the FBI's tried to strong-arm hackers. Join us or die type shit. Why now? The timing is suspicious, given her popularity. How much do you trust Ray? You might have cut a deal. Oh man, no way. Hey, trust me on this one. Maybe Miranda could help. Yeah, maybe. She uses a car service all the time. I'll tap into the feed and show up as a driver. Can I, uh, can I get you anything? Uh, I'm just leaving. But can I ask you a question? Mm hmm Do you think my friend's mask is hot or creepy? Both. You staying for another cup of coffee? I mean, that mask is pretty damn dope. Select Campy for hire. Okay, no, no, I'm good. I'm good on that. Okay. Oh, we have to select Campy for hire in the dryer. As okay. Cabby for hire. Yes. And the driver SF met. Hmm. Cabby for hire. Mark Marcus needs some time away from prying eyes to talk to Miranda. He decides to take her for a pleasant drive. Uh probably get an actual car for this. Oh, they give you a car for this? Well, that, why the hell is they? My car had called in so far away. I thought this was like the uh, Uber app. I thought I had to, you know, bring my own. This car is sick. You asshole! I bought my this car outright, chat. My own money. All right, that's why I, I, uh, I, I, I cherish it. My own hard-earned cash. Yeah, look at that. We gotta take this frickin' piece of shit. Damn it. Instead of my car that I... ...bought my hard-earned money. Oh, glove box looted. Gold ring. So would you guys consider Grand Theft Auto the act of Grand Theft Auto um, as savage? Like, does that add to the savagery? Just making a few extra bucks taking fares? As if. Where are you going? Going to visit my mother. No, no, I mean like the the act of me stealing a car from somebody. Would you guys consider that Follow savage? Caspi yep. says FBI. only if somebody else is if someone's driving it. We want to strike back, but I couldn't get all the data. 
I need to get into their Oakland office. You're coloring way outside the lines, Marcus. Yeah, and? Is that why you showed up as my driver? You think I'm being scoped by the feds, too? Isn't that why you wouldn't tell us where those photos came from? I was merely being prudent. And I'm being prudent by talking to you in person. So, Marcus, I'd be remiss if I didn't point out that a young man who discovers that the federal as long as you don't get caught. is after him <laughs> should probably re-examine some of his life choices. Good advice. Particularly a young black man. Guilty. Good. We've gotten that out of the way. So how did you get those photos of us in the bar? Let's just say I have a source. Does your source have anything else I should know? Word is the feds are going after hackers hard. They're trying to co-opt or blackmail every group they can. For what? They want control of all the zero days, and they don't want competition. Damn, now the FBI is in on it? Hacking might not be cool anymore. I'm not joking, Marcus. They're gonna come after DedSec, and they're serious. As for the FBI office, I have a friend that can help me. But you'll have to use the Moscow rules. What's that mean? It means there's an old-style payphone outside of Dellums. Pick it up, identify yourself as Fred, record the signal you get. Oh, that's fucking dope. <laughs> Gonna give you a shit rating on the driver app. <laughs> Thought I did a good job. I didn't even hit anything. Or anyone. So now we got to gain access to these towers. Wants to learn about the FBI surveillance? Okay. Noodle maps. Um, have you got the perk where you can steal cars without setting off alarms? No. Mainly because I, I didn't waste any points on it because I wasn't really stealing cars like that. But I probably should. If you guys are saying Grand Theft Auto is not that savage. Like me stealing people's... Now I'm not going to rip people out their car, you know, and throw them on the ground. But, you know, a parked car. They got insurance. You know what I mean? Oh my god, hi! I'm just Anyone know what's going on? What a dog I thought it was coming at me, dude. I was like, oh shit. I don't know. Here's the, here we go. This is Fred. Welcome, Fred. Bye bye. Totally quadrat. Doug with the super chat. It's minus 11 here with wins. Glad I'm not working. Yo, that's so bad, dude. I don't even know what it is here. We're supposed to have like a really bad storm. Um, they were talking about us potentially losing power and shit, so I was like, oof. Um. Hopefully it doesn't affect our second stream of the day. I don't think so. I don't think so. Yeah, the, the, the motorcycles, I've been able to take motorcycles and mopeds and shit, um, because they don't have alarms or anything on them. Okay, let's see. Open sesame. <laughs> <laughs> 
It's minus 11 here with high winds. Glad I am not working lol. I, I don't have a backup Jenny, Doug. No. Okay, Marcus. They gotta have some data pointing us to their spying post. Just tell me where to go to get but it. Thank That's you. Another video. super chat, man. And they're clever bastards. Looks like they've separated up all the data. I don't know which server to hack. Oh, great. So glad you waited until I'm inside to discover this little fact. Get up to the antenna on the roof and put a chat receiver on it. If I can track the data coming in, I can figure out which server is which. Sure, no problem. Go up on the roof, place a transceiver. Got nothing better to do. Well, shit. Hey, Frank. Uh, what the hell? Sorry, I was in a hurry. Got a backup, Jenny? Seriously, I didn't even get a chance. Um, I, I looked into potentially getting a backup generator for my house. Um, but it's actually quite the process, I, I guess. Like, you have to buy the generator. Um, and then, you know, for me to make sure that every single thing in my house is running off it, you know, it, you got to connect it to, like, your circuit breaker in your house. And they're 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 quite expensive from what I've seen. And uh, the actual process of hooking it up, I don't know what that entails. But uh, I'm pretty sure it's not easy. Uh, but, yeah, we failed yet. Um, that was quick. I need to get a camera. All right, so I gotta get in here. Got some access codes down here. Come on. Please, let me in that room, dude. Let me in the room, please. Might be able to hit this. I don't know if that's gonna be enough to get her attention though. I want to make sure it doesn't get his attention. So we're gonna let him walk away. See if we can hack this. Make some noise. And if she comes over, yep, there, perfect. Now we can get them access codes. Boom. None of these guys are hostiles, right? I am aware of the process lol I sell that stuff at work. With all the big bucks you get you should be able to. JK JK. <laughs> no, hey brother, thank you for the super chat, man. Yeah, it's definitely something I was looking into. Um even the wife brought it up at some point because something she's interested in trying to do. Um next year. You know, as long as everything goes smooth, it's probably something that we'll look into doing. Good. Oh, man. That's 
safe? Wait, 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 what, what, what? Didn't I get the access codes? Dude, this is gonna take a second. Don't waste time enjoying the view, buddy. Wait, what? what? Did, you, did that person snitch on me? Oh, they fucking snitched, dude. You gotta be careful with that shit. Like having civilians see you with guns, they snitch. Look at all these damn cops up here now. See if we can access this from here. So we got that going up, down, over. I can't see it from that freaking side. All right, you know what? We could probably do this from the drone. It'd be the easiest. We're coming up that way. Which way do we need it to go? See, this is why I don't know, so you can get stuff, lol. Uh, dude, thank you so much, Doug. Brother, you... Man, you don't understand how much that means to me, man. Okay, we got power coming in that way. Let's open this up really quick. One there. We got 65 seconds on this. Reboot. Looks like I gotta get all four to go in that way, so. Well, we got power coming here now. Power going there. One, two, three. Spin this. Unlock. Power going down. And that should be all four, right? Nope. I just lost that on this side. Yeah, we could do that. That should be all four now. How do I get eyes on it, though? I don't... I can't s Oh, maybe I just have to go inside here and see it. Yep, there it is. Got it. It's set. Great. Hold on. I'm tracing the flow now. I got nothing but time up here on the FBI's roof. Got it. Okay. I lit it up for you on your map. And back out. Now I have access, right? Pretty sure. Let's get back on the cameras and see where they want us to go exactly. It's going to require a physical hack. I 
think so. So we physically have to hack this shit. Damn it. Hack to open our access with jumper. Ooh, that would be nice. To be able to just drop right in. Alright, so let me see. How the hell are we going to get in that room? closer. So realistically, I, I could grab my jumper. I could get up in those vents, man. Oh, oh my God. Right up there. <laughs> come on, baby, you got it. Please, come on, you got it. Stop being a bitch. Stop doing this. Just get up there. Stop it. Why? Why do you gotta be like this? There you go. There you go. Whoa, 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 come on, dude. Yet. We're gonna have to get a little closer, aren't we? Closed circuit terminal. The terminal's right there. Requires a physical hack. Have to get a little closer. Um, see, this will probably give me the, what the hell? range I need right here. Just 
Leave it alone. The only issue is if I have to be within range, man. Even They're all going that way. There it is. Wrench, they're on to me. Uh, get out, get out. We don't have the location. I got a frequency. Go. See, I feel like that went well. Minus the, you know, when we first walked in and I, I obviously got spotted instantly, but once we got... Got the lay of the land, we were good. Can you cover for me at the ritual's on a whim? Now that's a fucked up lane. Frequently watches foreign news. Meat packer. Yo, somebody just came and just hit this man up. He was just a meat packer. What did he do? Oh, he's a, he was a meat packer, chat. He probably packed that, he, he was packing some meat. He must have had that good meat or something. He was packing the I'm out, but damn it, total fail. I got jack shit. Au contraire, dude. You got the hideout's frequency. We just gotta triangulate and we'll find out where it's at. I get it. The transceiver I left on top of Dellums is our first point. Right. I found a couple other antennas to complete the triangle. I'll hit one, you do the other. Marking it on your map now. Rough around here, chat. We're not even cast. We were in Oakland, man. I, I didn't know Oakland got down like that. <laughs> I did not know Oakland got down like that. Oh, damn, I always do. You're supposed to right click. Oh, sorry. 
messed up, man. I didn't even call in that drive-by either. It just happened. My bad, dude. I was trying to watch your dance. The road's that way. Hey, wake up. Holy crap. Well, go back to dancing, bro. I want to see what I want to see your dance. Trying to watch that man dance. Damn. And thank you guys. Almost 400 likes on the stream. I do appreciate it. Oh, damn. The car just kind of got away from me right there. Have I tried Subnautica? Yes, we've done. I did one episode of Subnautica on the channel so far. We ended up drowning in a cave by the end of the episode. He's all good. He's all right. Yeah, he's all right. Hey, Wrench, I'm about to get the third point here. Get it done, man. You get anywhere with that waitress? Gonna hear her back next Thursday. Dude. Yeah, she seems pretty together. Not like... We'll be right there. I'm not doing anything. On the ground, now. I'm just walking my cat. Ah! Wrench? Wrench! Shit! Oh, shit. Okay, who's well, gonna hack this? Sitara! Wrench went dark. The FBI got him. I heard that. Jesus. Give me his last location. It's no good. They'll take him to the hideout. You've got to finish the triangulation to find out where he is. Hurry. I'm trying. Relax, dude. Come on. Come on. I gotta get this. So we gotta unlock the top point first. Hit that. Where does this get power from? Yeah, they really went off on these puzzles. I like this a lot. It seriously did. So, yeah, that needs power. There we go. Yep. There it is. I love how they added him to the world. Yeah, the 1440. So, the reason why I'm only streaming in 1080, guys, um, for those of you guys who are wondering, 
Um, YouTube was having some issues with bandwidth yesterday. Uh, so I just kind of dialed it down so we didn't have that issue again. Uh, but I will crank it back up. But with the weather and stuff like that around the country, it's it's. I'm just not going to take any risks of it being uh being messed up. But hopefully the stream quality doesn't look terrible. Doug with another super chat, man. Uh, check out the game I mentioned a while back, Steel Rising. Yeah, there's that, and then Generation. What was it? Generation Zero. I think you told me about. Uh, that was another game I wanted to ch check out. Transceiver placed. Triangulating now. It's the old 16th Street Station. Let's see what's going on. Hack into their security cams. Hacking in now. Check out the game I mentioned a while back. Steel Rising. You see, my dad told me that Roy wore those glasses to get over his incredible stage fright. All right, I'm gonna ask you a question. Answer yes, you walk out of here a free man. Oh shit, there's his face. Who the fuck is Roy Orbison? Answer no, the mask stays off, you go to jail and you continue to be whoever it is. Looks like fucking MGK. Here's the deal. You're a member of Dead Set. Fact. You've meddled in federal affairs. Fact. You will be treated as a federal problem. Fact. I don't and see anything I can... You've got to give me a bunch of different options. You're an enemy combatant, which means rendition. Gitmo, if I get cranky. Unless... Unless what? Unless you help me get into Dead Sec. Get me their zero days. Get me the scoop on the whole gang. You are my way in. God damn it. All right, look. Right now, I am an act of God. Get me something. Point me in the right direction. Names, addresses. Because I swear to God, you want me on your side. You can't just Kill. walk it. This motherfucker, dude. I told him you were going to be a waste of his time. You're jeopardizing the investigation. You have no standing here. None. Go ahead. Call your boss. Call Chief Agent Monroe. Call her now. There's nothing in here we can do. What the hell is up with Marcus? He's a nice guy. He's misguided, but come on. He can't protect you from what's coming. The FBI is going to make an example of him. I mean, that's kind of what they do. It's too bad. But you. You have. See how much money this fucking dude makes? You can decide to. Be on board the the ride, or, or just get run over by it. You're rendering everything we've got against this guy inadmissible. Excuse me. His agent Fuentes is having a really hard time seeing the long term. So you're free to go. Tell your friends about the deal. If they want to be off the FBI's radar, they just got to come see me. <clears throat> yes, me! Or else, things ain't going to be pretty. No, 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 no. No. See, I think it's time you saw the world through your own eyes, like a big boy, and let the world see you for what you really are. Leave you two lovebirds to jerk each other off. Squirt that man out properly. <clears throat> Yo, this dude's fucking. <laughs> You motherfuckers! I'm coming to get that mask back! Wrench? I'm here. I'm getting your mask back. You saw that? Nobody does you like that. No, Marcus, man. You you got more important shit to take care of. For sure. Fuck that. I got your back. 
Definitely not worth it. Um, he can just make a new one. They thought we'd go for that. They don't get us. They don't get us at all. Wrench needs that mask. When one of our team needs something, we get it. Absolutely. Then I'm gonna hack their fucking server and get all the files about their little extortion plan. Time to air some dirty FBI laundry. No, that's dumb. I don't. I don't stand behind that. It is dumb. <laughs> He doesn't need the mask. Mask is cool, but it's not like he's Darth Vader and needs a breathing apparatus and all that shit. To survive. Sixteenth Street Station. Mask has gotta be here somewhere. Okay, so this place looks like a pain in the ass. Hey, who are you? Have you seen what they're doing to 16th Street Station? Seriously, I think they're restoring it or something. Okay, so they got a, a fence that goes around the perimeter here. There is a way to infiltrate here on this side and bypass that fence. Get up on the roof on this side. Yeah, they got a that electric fence. I don't know. I can actually probably grab that pickup truck over there to get on top of this container. Need a little bit of elevation. I don't know if there's any uh, forklifts around here. I'm gonna borrow this pickup truck. Hopefully, it doesn't make too much. Actually, I got my car. My car shouldn't sell, because if I grab that pickup, there's a chance I'm going to set off an alarm and shit. So, I mean, I could grab that uh, walker out of there, that little raise thing. But this should be high enough. I don't know if it's going to be high enough, to be honest with you. Perfect. Okay. Um. So there's one guard up top there. And I did see one down on the bottom. Let's get back into our drone. I think they went inside. Two guards up top. I could just send a walker in, or my jumper in. So I sh I I'll be able to get in on this side now. Let's uh... 
See if we can get the jumper going here. It's not going to work right now. So the door is blocked off in there. Thinking about getting this guy in a gang war. But I don't want to light the place up too much. Because there's so many cops and pretty... Oh, I can explode that. No, no, no. We'll keep it. We'll keep it clean. I need to get up on that roof. So we're gonna wait for her to go back inside. So we might be able to do this right now. Jet, it's going good, man. Might be able to get this guy right here. What? Take it what? Be advised, we have reports of a violent criminal near your location. Over. All right, that's a that's a little on the BS side. What the fuck? That was I that was clean, man.
Ah, who cares? I think we're clear up here now. Let's see. I had to go a little more aggro than uh, usual there, chat, but it was mainly because I got screwed out of that. I, I, I still don't agree with what happened there, but... What can you do, all right? Got the mask. Take good care of that thing. Yeah. Sending you their stuff now. Oh man, it's not just us. They've got stuff on all the hacker gangs here. That's their plan. I mean, like I said, it wasn't the smoothest, hackiest operation, but I still didn't kill anybody. Rich, stay put. I'm coming to return your stuff. I mean, I feel like I still used a lot of technology, even though I went a little aggro. Parking garage. I'm not gonna say full. Look at all these damn sp <laughs> Look at all these places to park. Do we go up one more level? Hmm. Might have to take like stairs or something up there.
down. Really? Seriously? Chris says, I say go all Punisher. <laughs> I was trying to figure out how to get up on the roof here. Up oh, there, okay. There's stairs going up. Bullshit. I'm sorry you had to go through that, man. You know all that shit that Dushin said? Does he wear the mask because he has a birthmark on his face? I would never turn on you. He's just trying to tear us apart. I'm not going to let him do that. Hey, Look, he's got the FBI on speed dial, and he's going to come after us hard, so I need all of you. We can't do this without each other. Or did they hit him? has been coercing hackers into providing them with hacking software for their own use. FBI uses this software to bypass the legal system and gain access to your private data with no oversight or warning. The FBI also illegally detained a DedSec member in an attempt to coerce us into working for them as well. To the FBI, we do not live in a police state. You are not the secret police. And the Constitution does not exist at your whim. We've exposed your plot to force hackers to help you. DedSec will continue to watch you for the sake of every free America. DedSec has given you the truth. Do what you will. And there it is. Yeah, chat, I just got some pizza and wings. Homemade. Absolutely starving, so... That's why I'm eating a couple of these wings real quick. It's that where I end the stream to go eat. <laughs> I'm starving. <clears throat> and if you guys have any questions why I eat this wing? So you're not just standing here awkwardly watching me eat a chicken wing? Oh, Sloppy Joe. Yo, I haven't had Sloppy Joe's in forever. They're just homemade buffalo wings. Eat the bone, too. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to lie. Back when I was in, like, school, um, you know, high school and stuff, you, I would get really hungry. And school lunch, when you'd get, like, when they would have wings, you only get, like, three. Literally, you only get, like, three wings. So I would be sitting there, I'd eat the bo the wings down to like the ball. I'd be sitting there chewing on like the cart. Like I'd be so hungry. <laughs> um, can you play online? Yes, in this game, there's tons of online features, tons of them. Uh, what do I think is the best Watch Dogs ever? Well, so far I've only played one and this one. Um, and I would I, I like this one more than Watch Dogs One at the moment. But also, like I said, it's hard for me to judge because the way I went about playing Watch Dogs One, I kind of just played it as a shooter. And I didn't really use any of the hacking and stuff.
No, I didn't meet her in the military. I've actually known my wife almost my whole life. Um, this is huge. But yeah, she cooks Scroll everything. Wedge between Bloom and the FBI. The feds need Americans to believe they're working in their best interest. If they're joined at the hip with Dushan, they're going to take a hit every time he does. And they know we're going to keep hitting him. Think we'll see the FBI back off? For now, I'd count on it. Uh, where, I'm at, where am I at currently in Star Wars? I am currently um, finishing up season one of Star Wars uh, Rebels. Yeah, I started the animated series Rebels. Uh, got to meet like Ezra and stuff like that. Rebels is pretty cool because uh, the stormtroopers now look like the stormtroopers from the red. There's, there's Tie Fighters, um, you know, starting to get more in line with the the stuff you see in like the first original, like episode four, five, and six. Um, it starts to get in line with that type of stuff. Uh, it's just cheese pizza, just cheese. Take those off for a sec. Hold on one sec, guys. I'm grabbing water. Uh, Doug with the super chat, man. Thank you so much. Uh, what's one of the things uh, you'd like but can't get for Christmas? Um, like for myself, I um I actually asked my um I actually got a, a pretty decent Christmas present this year for my mom, and uh, I wanted a toolbox because uh, I, I got a lot of tools and stuff. Uh, that I was using for like renovations and they're kind of just all over the place and I didn't really have anywhere to put them. Uh, so, so they actually went ahead and bought me like a really big toolbox, but I don't know what I would want outside of like, pretty much anything I would want, you know, I have, I use for work, you know, uh, Stifler, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. Sorry, guys. Like I said, I'm just trying to eat really quick. I'm just absolutely starving. Usually, I would just end the stream and go eat, but we're kind of still early, and I want to get this. I want to get a little bit more of this played. So I figured instead of ending the stream, just take a minute, eat really quick, and we'll keep it going. Poor Marcus just has to sit here and wait for me to eat. He's probably hungry himself. Uh, Sivania, hey, I appreciate that, man. Thank you so much. Yeah, I heard the weather's getting pretty nasty out there. Any of you guys got a in the storm right now? Have the bad storm going on? Doesn't seem to. Doesn't seem too bad here yet. <laughs> Watching the stream from Gotham City. <laughs> No one in Albany right now. Oof. Gave his uh, entire one mil charity. Yeah, 
That's amazing, Douglas. Holy shit. I know it was supposed to get cold here. I didn't know it was supposed to get that cold, though, man. You guys, some of you guys are fucking like six degrees. We're talking Fahrenheit, right? And those of you guys who are dropping the negative 18s and stuff, is that Fahrenheit? Or are we talking, because I don't even know what negative 18 Celsius is. That, that's probably not even all that cold. Because up here, up here, you know, we in, in, in upstate New York, we, we actually get like negative 18 degrees Fahrenheit. Jackson's like, yo, it's 70 here in LA. <laughs> uh negative 18 degrees is zero degrees Celsius. Oh wow. Or Fahrenheit? That's that's cold. Yeah. I'm nah. I was I'm I'm actually gonna go and get a haircut tomorrow. Um I had COVID for the past couple of weeks, so I couldn't leave the house. Uh, when you know, usually I, I get one my hair done, and my hair and my beard done uh, once a month, and uh, I generally, I generally, uh, you know, like I said, go once a month. But because I got COVID right when I would have went, now I had to wait another two to three weeks before I could go. And uh, but now uh, I was gonna go today. But Crystal had a bunch of run, errands to run and stuff like that. And uh, so I'll probably end up going tomorrow. <laughs> Killer. This is the quality content I watch the channel for. <laughs> right here. This is it. <laughs> this is it. I hate doing this stuff. I, and I do apologize to those of you guys who are here to just watch the game. Sorry, I am taking a couple minutes to eat. I usually don't do this. Like I said, I would just uh, end the stream. But like I said, I want to play this a little bit more. Um, so, yeah, I had to lower my camera. Uh, that way people stop looking at my chin. Because I, I noticed when I, when I stream, I end up like hunched forward. And like m my face is like this. So I kind of lowered my camera a little bit. <laughs> But no, those three guys, I appreciate you waiting. And I'm actually, hold on, let me go grab a couple of things real quick. Hold on. Oh, I had to get seconds, chat. I'm I, like I said, I'm, I'm really hungry. All I ate today, legitimately ate, was two things of yogurt, like little yogurt cups. It, that's literally all I ate. <clears throat> so I am starving. I just ate like the the wife gave me like five wings originally, and two slices of pizza, and I smashed that. So I went and got like. Six, seven more wings and another slice of pizza. <laughs> hmm. 
<clears throat> so any of you guys traveling anywhere nice for um for Christmas? Uh, yeah, I mean, you could say it's New York style pizza, but like I said, it's homemade. The wife makes it herself. The dough, like every, like she makes the whole pizza. I remember when she first started making pizza, she would uh, buy the like the pre-made like shells, and then she used to buy the pre-made dough, and then she learned how to do her own dough. And now she just makes literally everything homemade. What would I do? Without, yeah, I would I'd definitely be hungry. Hungry or, or my arteries would be clogged because I would just live off fast food. <clears throat> Alistair, you said you're at the beach? Ridiculous. It's the winter time, man. <laughs> it's the winter time. Yo, calamari is delicious. Fried calamari with some uh well, it depends on where you go. They got uh, sometimes I I could eat it with, you know, just tartar sauce or something like that, but a lot of places have like that little, that sweet sauce. I don't know what kind of sauce it is. Somebody in chat probably knows, but uh that sweet sauce that comes with calamari, it's so good. But summer where? Oh yeah, I forgot. Yeah, when your guys are down below the, I always forget that the um, that the world's like polar opposite. So I remember, yeah, it was like summertime, and people down in like South America were saying how it was winter, and I was like, what? It must be so weird because uh, when I went to Japan, their, uh, their wintertime was still on par with like what it is here in the United States. But I think it's because obviously where they're located above the equator. Well, Okinawa was like damn near on the equator. I live in Dominican Republic. Don't tell me where. <laughs> I mean, those of you guys over on the West Coast, I mean, 70 degrees is pretty respectable still. You know, that's pretty, that's like perfect weather, in our opinion, here in New York. It's not too hot. It's not too cold. I, I miss my days in Okinawa weather-wise, but the, I don't miss the summers. It was really, really hot. But wintertime, it was like 60 degrees, like dead of winter and it was cold like i actually found it to be cold but you just you get so acclimated to the weather that you know when 60 degrees is cold you got problems <laughs> i mean there's probably people in chat right now that <laughs> if it was 60 degrees where you lived that probably you'd probably freaking be freezing your ass off <laughs> and he said, I wish it was 60 degrees here in Jersey. So, hey, design 60 in Vegas right now. Would you consider that cold?
because all of us from upstate New York, we have this weird thing, and and, and only and only people that live in the north would truly understand this. Is the winter time? It gets cold here. It'll drop down below zero, be negative twenty degrees outside, really, really cold, and then it'll be like March, right? And we'll get this random day. It'll literally average, let's just say, five degrees outside. We'll get this random day that it just jumps up to like 45. Not even 30. Or like, yeah, like 35, 40 degrees, right? And you'll see people outside in fucking t-shirts and, and acting like it's summertime. Like, I, and it's 35 degrees out. It's just, it's wicked weird. <laughs> Like, Crystal used to be tripping, chat. Like, when we were up at Fort Drum, I remember it was one day, it was literally like April or something like that, and it was freezing. And we had one day where it got up to like 55 degrees, and she went, we went, and we went to the beach. We were at the beach. You remember that? Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, exactly. When you live up north, it's, you know, after the winter time hits forty degrees, windows down, you got people outside, yeah. shorts, yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm almost done, chat. I'm almost done. My dog is literally standing here, just like trying to catch some of these crumbs <laughs> but there is no crumbs okay so let's get our mission at least picked <clears throat> eye for an eye uh, track back Horatio's cell phone How cold is it outside here? People are saying it's like wicked cold where they are. Yeah, so yeah, it's actually pretty warm here for compared to what you guys are talking about. She, Crystal said it's thirty with a and with the wind chill and stuff. It the real feel is twenty two. Is there anybody in chat who has never seen snow in real life, though? Hmm. I'm from, uh, yeah, we're from upstate New York. Angel never, wow, so many people. Had until last year, October. Good <laughs> said, "Snow in real life sucks." <laughs> you know, all of us gamers, you know, you see snow in video games, and it's beautiful. And you're like, "Oh man, I love." I personally love when there's snow in video games. You know, games like Days Gone. Uh, you play things like Red Dead Redemption Two. It's it's so beautiful. But then once you see snow in real life, it's like, "Oh yeah, this shit looks nice." Uh -huh. All right, it, it, and that's it. Yeah, I'm over it. That's all it takes. Because you can't feel the temperature. You can't feel the windshield through the game. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, look at Ray Jr. For someone like me, you know, being from upstate New York, you know, to hear people say, I've never seen snow before. I'm like, what do you mean? What, what do you mean you've never seen snow? Yeah, like, doesn't it snow? Like, especially like me growing up as a kid. If you try to tell me that as a kid, I would definitely not understand what you were saying. Yeah. What do you do? Yeah, like if you've never seen snow before, how how do you go sledding? You know? 
snowball fight. No, snowball fight, sledding. Like, isn't that a vital part of like li like living? <laughs> so people, <laughs> they were like, "Hey, so you guys, you guys go snow uh, sledding. We just go to the beach." But I feel like like every kid needs to, you know, throw a snowball. Hey, John with the membership. Welcome to the family. I appreciate it, man. Hey, this side said we got two inches of snow about nine years ago. Shut down the entire city for a day. Oh man. See, see, Bobby, we only get a we get a very small window here in upstate New York for like summer activities. We get literally, I'd say what the end of June, I'd say July, because June it's still pretty chilly most of the time. A lot of stuff starts opening up right at the end of June, but there's been plenty of times, you know, it's it's still cold, like too cold to go like water parks and shit. So we get July, August, and about half of September. That's our summertime here in upstate New York. Um, and then the rest of it is cold. But for, for straight winter, we get November, December, January, February, March, April. And then in May, it starts to warm up a little bit. Now, the only difference between us and Jersey is they just don't get a lot of snow, but it's still freezing. It's summer damn near year-round in Texas. <laughs> yeah, not up here. We only get a couple months. Only get a couple months. Y'all had snow days. In Florida, we have hurricane days rolling on the floor, <laughs> laughing loudly, crying. Reason with the super jet. He said, y'all had snow days. In Florida, we have hurricane days. <laughs> Yeah, New Jersey's not too bad when it comes to the snow. Um, there's been the past year, the couple of years I was working with McLean, though, it was fucking terrible. 80 would be shut down. The whole, the whole freaking state turned into a snowbank. All right, there it is, chat. I'm done. I've eaten 14 chicken wings, three slices of pizza. Where'd my paper towel go? I don't have a paper towel, so my dog is cleaning my hand. Oh. <clears throat> All right. No, seriously, where is I literally had a paper towel. Now I got dog spit on my face. No. <laughs> <clears throat> there. All right, Chad, let's. Welcome to Brian Menard's Weather Channel, <laughs> where we discuss the weather. All right, let's do this. I'm still happy with how I uh, I took care of that mission, though. Uh, like I said, it wasn't completely stealth. Well, I would say it qualified as completely stealth, but it wasn't like a passive play style. We, uh, we did knock some people out. But we didn't kill anybody. Damn. 
All right, so let's get down to the road here. <clears throat> All right, so I'm about to do something really naughty right now, chap. Oh, about to steal this motorcycle. Keep your eyes on the suspect. I thought they wanted me. I was like, dude, I was just talking about stealing the bike. John with the super chat, brother. Thank you so much. Uh, when it's freezing in Scotland, it's minus two. Oh, yeah, that's cold, man. That's really cold. I thought those cops were coming after me. I was like, what the hell? I found the phone, but no Horatio in sight. There's got to be something. Damn, what are they doing over there? You see them sitting over there? On the grass chat? No clues, but there is a street cam. Okay, yeah. Hooking into the camera? Let's roll back the time code and see what happened. There he is. Who the hell's that guy? Get out of there, Horatio. Bam! Yeah! Jesus! Fight back, man! I don't believe this. Jesus, they're fucking kidnapping him! We gotta figure out who they are. Josh, get some facial wreck going. Fuck! That one's pretty clear. Louis Trevino. He's a member of the Tescas gang. The Tescas? Ah, oh, shit. We need Trevino's movements. Uh -huh. Got his phone number. GPS for centers on a building nearby. <clears throat> Putting it on your map. I'm not enabling him in the city. He brought crack into our home. That shit was around our kids. He was around our kids while he was high. I love him. He's family. This isn't easy for me, but no. Damn, run on my motorcycle. I had a motorcycle out here. Okay, so now we got to go track some kidnappers, which were gang members. This is going to be interesting. Uh, where the hell am I at currently? All right, so this is going to get kind of real. <clears throat> I don't know if I should show any mercy to gang members, though, really. You know what I mean? If they're, like, kidnapping us and sh Like, isn't that free game chat to be savagely dealt with? I should be able to unleash the beast. Fair game. What would Aiden Pierce do? No, the real question is, what would Casper do? I feel like I feel like these guys deserve the savage. What the fuck? Why is this? I gotta be a one-way street. rough around here get a little rough around these parts
All right, we'll, we'll try to get an idea on why they kidnapped, and then we'll, we'll deploy savagery after we've identified what's going on. Damn, we're just going right up in the dude's house. Hurry, <laughs> <laughs> show man. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here, man. Hold on. Hey, call 911, Josh. Call 911. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here, man. I'm here. Help's coming, okay? Hang on, hang on. Hang on, man. He's, he's dead, guys. Star Josh, he's fucking dead. Oh my god, Marcus, get out of there now! Fuck! Fuck. Okay, okay hold on, hold on, hold on. You're smart, right? Yeah, I'm smart. Not so smart, he didn't get caught. All that shit you seem to know, you're gonna feed to us. I'm not telling you shit. Fuck you. Fuck. Oh, fuck me, boy. No, 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 cuidado, cuidado. No, 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 pinche fuck. Get out of there, Marcus. You, you've got to get out. Not yet. I want to track these assholes down. Any unusual phone activity nearby? A lot, practically next door. Really, chat? Fuck! I want to track these assholes down. Any unusual phone activity nearby? Those dogs were gang members. They came at me. No, Caspi. After what they did, they, they're, they're not getting off easy, dude. I'm killing every single one of them. Dogs included.
Don't quite understand what happened. Oh, they're in a fight with somebody else, I think. <laughs> yeah, I see. I think they're fighting it out with the cops. So how do I activate the blackout chat? That's what I'm trying to figure out right now. Like, how do I activate that? <clears throat> no, no, Cass, we can't let the gangs kill each other, dude, because then that means I can't kill the gangs. Yeah, how do I activate this? No, like I like the way that this mission went already right now. I don't even I, I, I want them for myself. Does anybody know how to activate that? The I want to track these assholes down. Any unusual phone activity nearby? A lot, practically next door. Uh, it's in your phone. I don't know how to bring up another menu. It's fucking dogs, man. I don't even know how to. Oh, oh there we go. Uh, that's so. I got that weapon wheel. I want to track these assholes down. Any unusual phone activity nearby? A lot, practically next door. Is it that? Oh, it says G right there. I see it. <clears throat> okay, I know how to activate it. We're good. These guys baddies? Are they just wrong place, right, wrong time? Because they're not glowing red. We still don't want to take the life of any innocents. Ever. 
Oh, man. Ah! Hey, Cholo! Sure you're in the right ah, 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 turn it up! Turn it up! Ah. Ah, find the puta. What do you need, man? Coming in. Cocaine, gambling, extortion, weed. More cocaine. Names? Yeah. Good. Find out who the ones that grabbed Horatio are. Y'all hear me? What the hell's going on with these phones? I want the test because they know I'm coming for them. Burn something down, man. <laughs> yeah. I'll burn the pot field. It's right here. They use an illegal pesticide. At high volume, it's extremely flammable. I'll just switch the irrigation system to the pesticide. Then flood the fields with it and light it up. Hey, get down! Ah! Let's start the show. It's locked! Fuck! All right, that should get their attention. Get out of there. We're looking through the data to figure out the next target. Lucky the police showed up, ma'am. <clears throat> The reason why I wasn't using my stun gun is those people, they, they killed our boy. <clears throat> no mercy. No mercy, chap. Not, not with that. Now those fuckers know we're after them. Let's do something that'll really hurt. We're with you. They're about to ship out a huge cargo of cocaine. I've marked it on your map. Destroy the coke, and it'll hit the Tescas hard.
Hey, see anything? Good to see you, Retro. You know the whole DeadSec community is with you on this. Everybody likes Horatio. I'm sure he'd appreciate it. What's the story here? I hacked into the security cam and rolled it back a few hours. You can see the Tezcas loading crates onto the boat. There's a ton of guys with guns. I like a challenge. Thanks for the heads up. Good luck, Retro. <clears throat> My bad. Sorry. They won't like that. Three more of them. I think we got them all. There it is, chat. They killed Horatio. There's no... No mercy. Shit destroyed. Down to two.
That takes care of that one. One more to go. Entire cocaine shipment destroyed. The Tuscas know we're serious now. Better get out of there. Well, I hope they know we're freaking serious. <clears throat> Do you think we got revenge, Shep? Do you think we even the score? I don't know. I feel like I feel like we need to take kill every the whole gang. So at least people in chat now know that there is combat in the game. <laughs> Alright, the test is in that video, the ones grabbed Horatio and killed him, then next. The main guy is Pablo the Skinner. He's hidden away somewhere. The other ones are Luis Trevino, Tina Huerta, and Jorge Gutierrez. They're meeting in the dry canals to figure out what to do about DedSec. Good. Let's get them. Okay, I'm at 23,000. Like, I, I tried, guys. You know, I, I was I was playing, you know, not being a savage. I was trying to do the right thing. Then they just stabbed Horatio in the gut. You reap what you know, you reap what you sow. They did this. Good to see you, Retro. All of DedSec is proud of how you're fighting for Horatio. Thanks. What's going down? I've been listening in on their phone calls. Trevino is there already. The other two are on their way. That's all I need to know. You get yourself someplace safe. Good luck, man. Yeah. <laughs> 
It's a friendly dog. That's a good doggy. I'm tracking Gutierrez. He's arriving at the site. Got a bead on Tina Huerta. She's just arrived. She'll regret it. He was the one that fucking stabbed him. does not have the range. Okay, so the, the handgun is not good at, even when you scope in from that range. Tracking Gutierrez. He's arriving at the site. There she is. Got a bead on Tina Huerta. She's just arrived. She'll regret it. Why didn't she die? I shot her in the face, didn't I? Tracking Gutierrez. He's arriving at the site. Andale. Find the puta. Debemos acabar con este cabrón. Tengo una chica de mierda.
the so the main dudes don't die with a single headshot. You got Yeah, they're like way stronger. Okay, well at least now I'm tracking. It's all good, Chan. We're gonna I'm do it. Tracking Gutierrez. He's arriving at the site. Luis Trevino won't bother us anymore. Bastard. She'll regret it. That dude doesn't even die in one shot either. So the big guys with the shotguns don't die in one hit. Puerta's out. Marcus, the last one's making a run for it. Don't let anybody get away, man. It's not much, but I just wanted to say you got a lot of effort out into YouTube for a smaller channel. A lot of big streamers don't put in this much work. That ass hat Gutierrez Keep up the is good taking work, care homie. of. Hey, Kazu, thank you so much for the super chat, man. A small measure of justice for Horatio. Get out of there. That bastard Pablo is next. I really appreciate that, man. I try, you know, I, I try to make up um, for not being as big and as popular and, and good. I just try to, you know, work as hard as possible. But I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. So you could still kill him in one melee hit. Uh... But yeah, when you go to shoot those dudes, they're super powerful. Would I have like a full automatic rifle or something? <laughs> no point. All right, time for the ringleader. Pablo the Skinner. I've tracked him to the dogfights in Oakland, Chinatown. We got a dead sick member out there casing the joint for you. Let's get this guy, Marcus.
Yeah, I'm pretty sure the guns have different like stats and stuff, and I, I'm pretty sure the suppressed pistol probably has the lowest damage out of all the guns. Is there a way to check that, like your inventory? Yeah, so even just a regular handgun has more stability. more damage and everything. So all valuables. We actually had quite a few valuables on us. You sure about that? All right. We're going to go into this one a little more strategic. Doesn't mean I'm showing mercy, chat. I'm just going to be a little more smart about it. A little smarter about it. Let me see, do I also have any points yet? Yeah, we got a couple points we could spend here. You need to start working on some of these vehicle hacks. Some of the missions, you know, when you you gotta. Oh, here it is. It's like nitrous gadgets. So these are the electric grenades. Explosive device. What? No. I I, th I did upgrade my jumper's jump. I don't know if there's another level to it, but oh shit. Think they were going at it for a second there. I thought this mission was literally right. I would have grabbed a car if I would have known it was this far. There it is.
Hey. Retro. What's the deal here? Dog fights go down in that building there. Used to be an indoor swimming place or something. They only admit members, though. Any way I can slip in? Pretty sure you can go through that restaurant. Good luck, man. Anything any of us can do to help? Thanks. We need a low profile here. I'll head in alone. Restaurant, there's no way in. Uh, I might have to go around. The thing was, is there was a decent amount of guys on the high ground. Oh, yeah. There's sleeping dogs in here, isn't it, chat?
Gatsby, is this how you handled business, bro? This is Watch Dogs 2, yep. You made them all pay dearly. Let's do this. Damn, he killed a dog. He killed a dog, chat.
can kill the dogs pretty easily. I didn't realize those big guys were the ones that didn't die in a single shot. out pretty much anyways I might as well just fucking Yeah, this gun hits hard as fuck. And thank you for over 500 likes, everybody. I do appreciate it. Marcus, you gotta get out of there. We're monitoring the Tescas. You're in trouble. The whole gang is converging on you. The place will be swarming with Tescas.
It's a regular guy. For Horatio, chat. For Horatio! All right, now we can go back to being peaceful. Got them all, man. I did get them all. I didn't get there quick enough, brother. Shit, man. Tesco's gonna come after any one of us, dude. Me, you, Josh, anybody. They went after Horatio, and he refused to give us up. Be along in a bit, man. I think they got the message. You know what I mean? Do you guys do, do you guys feel like they got the message, chat? You think we nailed it home? Oh yeah, that gang killed the shit out of our our buddy, man. Ray, my man. Marcus. For no fucking you guys reason been either. Kicking ass up and down this city, man. Woo. I'm not one for mushy shit, but <laughs> I appreciate it, really. I'm hanging out on the coast. Come meet me when you're ready for the biggest job yet, baby. <laughs> Harbor authorities chased yet another unlicensed craft back into international waters. So far, there are no details on where the craft originated from. Incidents of illegal vessels venturing into U.S. waters has been increasing. Speculation is that corporate spies are attempting to target the secrets of tech companies concentrated in Silicon Valley. And there it is, chat. So, we will end this episode here. Um, I do appreciate you guys for coming and hanging out today. I hope you guys are enjoying the stream. Um, <laughs> Tess doesn't give up, does he, chat? Test. How? You, wh why do you always come and then, and then you you say stuff? I prove you wrong, and then you never speak. Like your argument is 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 so terrible. Test is calling you all bots again, chat. We got all. <laughs> we yeah. But we 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 got it done, chat. We got it done. Beep, beep, boop. Because <laughs> he'd be trying to test our patience. <laughs> oh. Uh, but we're going to be playing some Assassin's Creed Odyssey next. Um, that's going to be that's going to be our uh, our next game. Guys, you remember Testicles from uh, from Odyssey? I miss him. I miss him already. No, I think I think Test is a bot. He, he must be.
He only comes in. Well, no, it, it, it would be a super, it'd be a super extravagant buck because Tess does say different things every time he comes. Like this time, he said even during Christmas. Um. So. At least he doesn't say the same exact thing every time he comes. But thank you guys again, uh, all of you bots in the chat, you know, for showing up. I, I appreciate it. <laughs> it's so stupid. Uh, but I, I do appreciate you guys uh, for coming and hanging out. And like I said, we're going to be doing some AC Odyssey next. Now, people are dumb, man. They just don't understand. Like, like you could bot on Twitch, um, like botting your viewers on Twitch, like people do it, and it, it serves a purpose on Twitch because the way Twitch shows people, like, um, like showcases your channel is based off of how many live viewers. So the more live viewers you have, the higher you are up in the, the rankings, I guess you could say. Uh, but on YouTube, there's no such system. So... If you're if you're botting viewers, I could have a million live viewers watching me right now. Um, if you could even buy, I don't even think it's possible. YouTube would easily ban you. Uh, but if you were botting your viewers, even if I had a million people watching me, it wouldn't do anything for me. Uh, you know what I mean? Um, because YouTube wouldn't count the views because they would be able to tell it was bots. So I wouldn't make anything from the bots. Um, and... It, the amount of viewers that watch you have zero gravity on the caliber of stream that you're putting out. Uh, you know what I mean? So it, it doesn't. It's just people who don't know what the fuck they're talking about. No, but I, I appreciate all you, all you sophisticated bots that come and you like the stream and become channel members and all that. I do appreciate you all for being here. Um, is AC Valhalla any good? I don't know. I haven't played it yet, Tommy, but we will be playing Valhalla soon. We'll be beating uh, Odyssey here soon. So uh, let me get a couple minutes chat. I'm going to go get that uh, stream set up, and we will be playing some Assassin's Creed Ooh, Odyssey. I almost said Origins. All right, but if you have it on your way out, smash that like button. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. And other than that, I appreciate you all, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.